Yesterday, Phil said the defense has got to keep playing together. What did you kind of see out of the defense over the last couple of weeks of the season? How do you all keep that going into the playoffs? Uh, I think, you know, just developing a stronger brotherhood. Uh, you know, when you get in those tough moments in games where you really got to fight four quarters, uh, focus on one player at a time, uh, you know, it just automatically makes your team closer. Uh, you have to rely on the guy next to you. You have to trust the guy next to you to do his job, especially in clutch moments like that. And, you know, once we develop that, that's just something we want to keep going. Charlie. Yeah, just uh, hey Christian, what what are your early impressions of Cincinnati after you know getting a quick look at them? Uh, I think they're a very great team, very explosive. Uh, I mean, I know they beat some good teams this year, and uh, they put up a lot of points, um, as well as like their passing game. Uh, they have a really great quarterback. Uh, of course, their running back. You know, he's been I think he's over like a thousand yards right now already. So, uh, you know, they're a very successful team, very dangerous, and you know they've shown in the past that they can compete with good teams. So. Uh, it's definitely a great challenge for us. John. Uh, Christian, I had a couple on, on Will Anderson. First off, it's kind of a weird question, maybe, but how would you describe his intensity level on and off the field? Because even when he's talking to us, he's he looks like he wants to, you know, to tackle us. <laughs> no, yeah, it's crazy you say that. I said something to Will yesterday, actually, because uh, you could just see him in the facility. His face is the same as he is on the field. And, you know, he was just saying that he's locked in. That's just his mentality all the time. And, you know, a lot of people feed off of that and, you know, want to stay locked in as well. And it kind of helps us with performance when it comes to practice because, you know, we are what we work, know what, we are, what we're working for. Tony. Christian, uh, Ty Simpson was able to join the team early. Have you gotten a chance to see him at all uh, on the scout team yesterday? And what, what are your thoughts of him as a, as a prospect? I mean, I saw him yesterday, but like I said, I mean, we're mainly all focused on Cincinnati. Uh, we're all one team, so uh, we're all just really trying to focus on getting better right now and preparing for this game. But uh, like I, said, I saw him yesterday. Michael. Yeah, in Cincinnati, does their offense look like anybody you faced this year? Any comps to uh, opponents you've seen this year in the SEC? I mean, just being an explosive offense, being able to do a lot, uh, whether it's pass or run the ball, and do that successfully throughout the season. Uh, I mean, I think there's a lot of teams that's been able to do that, that we played. And, you know, it presented, like I said, a really great challenge for us, and we're ready for it. Charlie. Yeah, I want to ask about a guy we haven't seen much of this season in, in Kyrie Jackson. Uh, with a couple of guys at corner being banged up, just what have you seen from him, and how confident are you guys in Kyrie? Uh, you know, he has really good confidence in himself, uh, regardless of, you know, what situation he was in all year. I mean, he came in day one and just continue to work and take one day at a time. You know, that's something he's been doing. And of course, you know, we're still helping him out. Uh, we help all, we help everybody out, help, help each other out in practice and make sure everybody's on the same page. So, uh, like I said, he's doing a real good job right now. John. Yeah, sorry, I was going to ask a follow up on Will. What is, in your opinion, you think he's the best defensive player in the country and, and what makes him so good? Uh, Will being Will, uh, who God created him to be. I mean, he's 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 a great player. Uh, he has a great attitude, great energy, and he positively affects everybody around him, which I think is a, a really big thing as far as being a leader on our team, uh, being able to positively affect your teammates, and, and you know when moments get tough to pick those guys back up or just lead by example by going out there and dominating the next man. It kind of makes you want to do the same thing. So he leads in many different ways. Last question, real quick, Tony. Yeah, Christian, uh, Desmond Ritter, what, what challenges does he pre uh, present as a quarterback and just how are you preparing for him? I mean, a lot. I mean, like, that's what I'm saying. Like, with, their, with, with Cincinnati, like I said, they have a really explosive offense, so they have the ability to be able to sit there and pass in the pocket if they want to or extend plays or get out the pocket. Like I said, they can also have a really great running back, so they have weapons all around offense.